The controversial citizenship amendment bill was introduced in the Lok Sabha today after around 90 minutes of heated debate followed by voting. The controversial bill seeks to make it easy for non-Muslim refugees from Pakistan, Bangladesh and Afghanistan to become Indian citizens. Here are some points to update you with this big story. Home Minister Amit Shah said the bill is not even 0.001% against India's minorities. Senior Congress leader Shashi Tharoor said, those who believe religion should determine nationhood, that was the idea of Pakistan. In the notice that Mr. Tharoor gave this morning, he said the bill endorses the idea of religious discrimination by allowing individuals of only six religious identities to acquire citizenship while excluding the individuals belonging to other religious identities. Samajwadi Party Chief Akhilesh Yadav said they are against the bill. The party will oppose it at all costs. Uddhav Thackeray's Shiv Sena said vote bank politics under the garb of the bill is not in the interest of the country. The Sena in an editorial in its mouthpiece also questioned the timing of the bill. There is no dearth of problems in India now but still we are inviting new ones such as CAB. It looks like the center has made an invisible partition of Hindus and Muslims over the bill said the party. Parliamentary Affairs Minister Pralhad Joshi said the bill is in the interest of the northeast states and the entire country. This bill is in the interest of northeast states and the country. The bill will get the nod from both the houses of parliament he said. In Assam, prominent student groups have threatened to launch an all-out agitation, similar to the one from last year, if the bill is passed. The Narendra Modi government had introduced the bill in its previous tenure too, even gaining the Lok Sabha's approval, but could not introduce it in the upper house due to protests in the northeast. The legislation eventually lapsed. The original Citizenship Act of 1955 stated that individuals seeking Indian citizenship should have lived in the country for 11 of the last 14 years. The amendment proposes to reduce that time period to five years for non-Muslim applicants, and grants them immunity from government action pertaining to their illegal status.